Hello everyone, this is Mark with the Cover Cats of Robertsdale, Alabama. Area code 251-213-0559. We're working today with an Alpha So. We've had this machine for about maybe, I'm going to say maybe about six months and we've only used it for about 150 hours. I uh, just got done doing a top stitch on here so I'm not going to bore you to death with that. I do want to show you the other features that it has. So without further ado, we're going to get right into it. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to set this for straight stitch. Then we're going to move to zigzag. And I'll tell you what, we're going to flip this over so we can show the black on white contrast for you. So you can see it a little better. Alright, let me change that stitch length here. Now, let's go to zigzag. This is the full throw of the zigzag. And what I'm going to do now is from that position, which was center justified, we're going to take this back to zero and move it to left justified. And I'm not going to hold my hands in here or anything. I'm just going to show you this on the fly. So give me just a second because I don't want to get my fingers in the camera or anything like that. All right, so uh, let's do this. Let's get the needle in it. Raise up the presser foot. Come back towards the camera. And put the needle back in it. Raise the presser foot up. The clearance on the presser foot is about 3 eighths. It's not very much, which is also one of our concerns because we sew many layers of fabric up to 10 layers at a time. Uh, we don't have enough clearance on the foot, so that's why we're selling it. All right, put the foot back down. And what we're gonna do now is show left justified. This is left justified, center justified, right justified. around the back side here and show you what that did so we started off left justified then center justified then right justified see that it has a very beautiful zigzag stitch back there in the back can't see it will help you zoom in a little bit This is an alpha cell, as I said before. It has a very small motor, so sometimes it feels like it's underpowered, but it still rock and rolls. We're selling this unit for $350. If you like it, give us a call. <laughs> 